And joining me is Dr. Kathy Magliato, cardiothoracic surgeon at St. John's Medical Center in Santa Monica, also author of a book called Heart Matters. How common are problems like this that, that uh, Michael Clark Duncan experienced? As you know, heart disease is our number one killer, whether it's for men or women in the U.S. But this particular type of heart attack where the heart stops, we see that about a thousand times a day, day in, day out in the United States. In this show today, we're talking about silent symptoms because mm -hmm. as atherosclerosis or plaque buildup occurs, it's largely silent. And what's right. interesting, when you look at the statistics, every 34 seconds, someone in the U.S. has a heart attack. But maybe even more shocking, every minute, every single minute, someone dies from a heart-related disease. Mm -hmm. And one of the things we want to talk about today is how early heart disease actually develops and evolves. Because mm -hmm. what can happen is in your 20s, you can actually exactly. develop buildup of plaques. And, and what occurred in the case of Michael Clark Duncan is he actually had his heart stop. And when his heart stopped, what occurs is in your brain, like you just saw there, you don't get blood flow. Right. It's called cerebral anoxia. Literally, your brain gets no oxygen. Mm -hmm. And as time progresses, you know, there's critical moments right. there. Every minute is critical. For every minute, every single minute that we withhold CPR on these patients, it decreases their likelihood of survival by 10%.